Stop it. Get some help. You're never gonna make it, you're not good enough There's a million other people with the same stuff You really think you're different, man, you must be kidding Think you're gonna hit it, but you just don't get it It's impossible, it's not probable, you're irresponsible Too many obstacles, you gotta stop it, yo You gotta take it slow, you can't be a pro Don't waste your time no more Who the fuck are you to tell me what to do? I don't give a damn if you say you disapprove I'm gonna make my move, I'm gonna make it soon And I'll do it cause it's what I wanna fucking do Cause all these opinions and all these positions They come in in millions, they blocking your vision But no, you can't listen, that shit is all fiction Cause you hold the power you're as long as you're dreaming there's no way that you make it. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel Tech Up To Date. Hope you guys are doing well. Today's video gonna be super special for those who wishes to play Valorant in their low-end PC or laptop. If you watch this video completely and follow my steps properly, I can assure you that you can play Valorant with maximum possible FPS without any lags or stutters. Watch this video completely. If you are new to this channel consider subscribing. Without any further delay, let's proceed by rolling an intro. First and foremost step is cleaning all the junks out there, these junks holds a lot more space than expected, an action to be taken immediately, or it will consume your RAM bit by bit. To delete those unwanted guests, you need to press Windows plus R simultaneously, then this program will pop up. Then type percent temp percent and press enter. These are the junks to be cleaned for better performance. You need not to worry about those files, it won't delete any of your data, these is just temporary files, as the name itself depicts, it won't disturb your data. If some files doesn't get deleted, just leave it. Again the same process, but this time type temp alone. These are also the junk files, delete them without showing any pity to it. Congratulations! You have disposed all the junks from your PC or laptop. You will see some rapidness while opening applications and also while multitasking. In the next step we are going to change the resolution of our display, which literally helps a lot in increasing FPS. Just right click on the screen and click this. Here you can find an option called Display Resolution. Click there and set to 1280x720 for maximum performance. I won't change this, it may interrupt my recording, but you do it without fail. After that go to Advanced Display option. Here you will find Refresh Rate, set it to maximum. Here it is 75, it might be 120, 90 or even 60 in your case. You must select the maximum possible. I am selecting 75 as it is the maximum, and no way it affects the FPS. In fact the enhances the user experience. For AMD users there is a bonus option for you, right click on the screen and select AMD Radeon software. Go to setting. Then graphics. Here you will find an option called gaming, click and set your processor's performance to gaming mode for better output, you can also turn on free sync on AMD or G-Sync on NVIDIA, if your monitor supports the above syncs. This helps to make our experience smoother. Now the crucial steps begin. Steps at the back end of the game is completed. Let's get into Valorant. Just go to game settings and copy these exact settings as it is shown here, this is the best possible settings for higher frame rate without losing too much of graphics and textures. Implement this exactly. Now you can see the gameplay and FPS. This is insane. It is 10 times faster now. Due to OBS screen recorder, it sucks 20 to 25 FPS. Otherwise, it is even smoother than this. That's it for today guys, hope you would have enjoyed this video. Do let me know which game you like the most. Hit that like button and share this with your friends. Consider subscribing our channel and turn on notification bell to get notified whenever I upload a video. 
Thanks for watching, stay safe, stay happy and keep gaming.